Welcome, my name is Max Hackman, and today we're going to check out the Opposing Viewpoints and Contacts database. In order to get there from the library's main webpage, you want to scroll down and check out the database link on the right hand side of the page. Select that. This will take you to an alphabetical listing of all of our databases. We want to go into O for Opposing Viewpoint. There we are, it's the second one listed here. I've already logged in. If you have any trouble logging in, you can check out the tutorial on our YouTube page, or you can call or text, uh, text or actually chat with us online, uh, and we can help you out with that. Once you get into the database here, um, you scroll down. On the main page is a bunch of uh, uh, main issues of the day. Uh, these are, as you can see, updated and changed uh, daily. Um, if none of these are what you're interested interested in, um, you can browse all issues. Give it a second here and then it'll come up and as you can see there's a lot of different issues. Today I'm going to show you guys the one on pollution. Give it a moment here to fully load. As you can see it's not quite there yet. Just give it a second. Perfect. Um, so it kind of breaks it down to everything that is on this page. Um, you can search through academic journals, uh, the featured viewpoints, and the regular viewpoints. Those are both the same things. The featured viewpoints are just the ones that the editors have chosen. Um, this database also has primary sources, so this works out very well um, if you're looking for a primary source document. So uh, keep that in mind in the future. Um, let's just check out, we'll scroll down here, we'll check out a featured viewpoint. All right, once we're in here, we have a bunch of information. Um, noticing on the top here, you can the citation is at the very top. Um, if you select that, you're provided with three different citations. Um, so make sure you're grabbing the same one every time. And also note that these are machine generated, so uh, you might want to double check uh, what they're providing you with, but this is a great place to start. Um, the get the link is the permalink for this page. So if you want to come back here, uh, you can just select this link and save it somewhere and you can come back. Um, that's very useful. Uh, then uh, you scroll down a little bit, you have the author's name, uh, where it's from, the document type, and it'll tell you the length uh, in words actually, so a little bit different. Uh, this database also allows you to listen to it, so you can uh, just listen to a word or two, or you can actually download the whole uh, document in an mp3 format, so pretty neat. Keep that, keep that in mind. You can also download the document right here. Um, if you have any other questions or any other uh, needs, uh, please feel free to reach out to us either through our chat or email services right now, and we'll uh, be glad to help you. Thank you.